Hello everyone! In this video, I will show you how to design a modern student ID card in Microsoft Word. Let's get started. To begin, let's set up the page layout. First, customize the page size. Set it to 5 by 2.827. Enable alignment guides for easier object placement. Now, remove margins from all sides. In the Design tab, change the colors to blue too. For fonts, click on Customize Fonts and select Poppins for both heading and body. You can download the font. The link is provided in the video description. Now, insert the university picture. Resize and, and place it on the right side using alignment guides. Next, draw a rectangle. Remove its outline. Set its size to 1.2 by 5 and position it on top using alignment guides. Change its fill to gradient linear down. Right click and open shape format. Open fill drop down and change transparency to 10%, 20% and 80%. Now, draw a text box, remove its fill and outline. Set its size to 0.25 by 3.1. Position it between 0 and 0 0.3. Next, draw another rectangle. Change its fill and remove the outline. Set its size to 1.92 by 1.89. Change its rotation to 338 degrees. Position it between 0.27 to 0.28. Now copy shape 2, change its color, set its size to 1.34 by 0 0.1, position it between 1.65 and 0 0.09. Resize and adjust the picture accordingly. Now insert the university logo. Resize and adjust it to the left side. Next, draw a rectangle. Change its color and remove the outline. Set its size to 1.46 by 5. Position it between 0 and 1.17. Copy the rectangle and change its color. Set its size to 0 0.2 by 5. Position it between 0 and 2.63. 
Now copy shape three. Position it between 4.1 and 252. Right click and send it to back. Next, draw a rounded corner rectangle. Set its size to one by one. Change its outline color and weight to two into one over four. Position it between 3.68 and 0 0.67. Now change the shape fill to a picture. Make sure your picture must be in square size. Adjust corners. Now draw a text box. Remove its fill and outline. Set its size to 0 0.87 by 2.07. Position it between 0 0.17 and 1.34. Now enter your details. Hold shift and enter. Hold shift and enter. Next, draw another rectangle. Change its color and remove the outline. Set its size to 0 0.22 by 155. Position it between 0 0.28 and 2.38. Now draw a text box, remove its fill and outline. Set its size to 0 0.3 by 155. Position it between 0 0.28 and 2.28. Now draw another rectangle and remove its outline. Set its size to 0 0.5 by 0 0.5. Position it between 2.43 and 1.46. Give it a shadow. Now insert the QR code. Make sure the QR code is also in a square size. Next, draw a text box. Remove its fill and outline. Set its size to 0 0.26 by 0 0.74. Position it between 2.31 and 1.94. Now draw another rectangle. Change its color and remove the outline. Set its size to 0.01 by 0.51. Position it between 2.42 and 2.14. Now insert your signature. resize and adjust accordingly. Now draw a text box and remove its fill and outline. 
set its size to 0.42 by 1.35. Position it between 3.5 and 1.66. Now click on the dialog box launcher. Click on Advanced. Select spacing to condensed by 0.9. Now draw another rectangle. Change its color and remove the outline. Set its size to 0.11 by 1.02. Position it between 3.66 and 1.99. Copy the text, signature. Set its size to 0.22 by 1.02. Position it between 3.66 and 1.93. Now copy the signature underline. Set its size to 0.01 by 1.02. Position it between 1.66 and 2.14. Next, draw another rectangle and remove its outline. Set its size to 0.33 by 1.02. Position it between 3.66 and 2.22. Give it a shadow. Now insert the barcode. Right-click and send it to back. Now here is our final ID card layout. You can download this template for free from the link in the video description. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family.